While the mainstream media may be portraying the Dutch farmer protests as an anti-environmentalist movement peopled by selfish farmers, Vandana Shiva, with her experience in how corrupt, centralised, agricultural, monocultural giants are oppressing independent farmers all over the world, this is connected to the land grab of Bill Gates, this is connected to corruption of companies like Monsanto, this whole fertiliser situation is a scam. They present it as a green ideology. Oh, we can't keep using these fertilizers and anyone who lives in the rural area will know that when those fertilizers get used you think oh god is this a bit dodgy but the reason that farmers are using those fertilizers is because it's necessary economically because of the pressure they are under financially because of often because of government enforced imperatives and the objective isn't to get the farmers to behave in an organic responsible ecologically apposite manner no, far from it. It's in order to bankrupt the farmers so that their land can be grabbed. My mind was blown by that. This shows you how the Great Reset operates. It uses a green agenda, and just so you know, I agree with the green agenda. I think that the planet should be treated with love and respect, that we should see ourselves as in harmony with it. But when regulations are passed down from a globalist level and it affects the lives of ordinary farmers, it's the duty of all of us to support them, to stand in solidarity, to give them time to make those transitions, to say to the farming and agricultural community, we'll support you by buying your products if you make these concessions and changes, which we'll agree between us. It doesn't need to be mediated by technocratic globalist bodies. We, the people, can make these decisions together. 